Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you a tutorial. Now usually when I start off my videos, I already have the makeup on, but today I just decided not to because I wanted to show you uh, the products that I will be using beforehand. Now, it is the holiday season, which means a lot of the stores all the makeup stores like MAC and Sephora and Ulta, they're all coming out with holiday sets or holiday bags, whatever. And I picked up one that I thought was an amazing, amazing value and I needed to share with you guys what it was. So what I got was from this. This is from Sephora with uh, inside of JCPenney. I believe that this is a Sephora JCPenney exclusive because when I went to the Sephora store in uh, where around where I live, they didn't have it but they had it inside the JCPenney one. Now, I no longer have the bag because I give the bag to my friend because, I mean, I have a million bags. I don't need another one. So, let me show you what this thing includes right here. So, this includes a Beauty Blender Pro, a Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Opal, a Buxom uh, Lash Mascara in the Blackest of Black, a Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper, a NARS Cosmetics Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in Cruella, and the Urban Decay eyeshadow in Mushroom. Now, I the Beauty Blender, the Kat Von D eyeliner, the Buxom mascara, and the Urban Decay eyeshadow, they are all full-size products. They are not no baby little sizes. These are all full-size products. And the Becca highlighter in Opal and the NARS matte lipstick, these are travel size slash mini sizes. So this is a $122 value for $39. Now I only paid around $33 I believe because I was a beauty insider and I went during their 20% off sale. So I got this amazing deal on top of that 20% off. Can you ask for anything better? Now, alone the Beauty Blender is a $20 value. The Kat Von D is another $20 value. That's $40 already right there. And then you get everything else for free pretty much. So I wanted to bring you guys a tutorial using all six of these products. Of course, I'm going to be using them with other things as well. But I wanted to mainly do a tutorial just using these products. So if you guys want to see the makeup look that I will achieve using these six products, keep on watching. So I'm first gonna go in and moisturize my face slash highlight it up a little bit. I like, I've been doing this lately and I've been loving it. I am going to be using the Max Strobe Cream in the color Gold Lit. And it has a beautiful gold shine to it. And I'm just going to be applying this with my Beauty Blender. Now that I have one. I've never had a Beauty Blender before actually. I've always used the Real Technique Complexion Sponges and I have loved those. And this is my first time trying out a Beauty Blender. Next, I'm gonna go in with foundation. For foundation, I'm gonna be using the MAC Lightful CC Tinted uh, Moisturizing Cream. And I'm going to just mix this a little bit with my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow Foundation. Now, I will say so far my review on the Beauty Blender is, it's a little too soft. I don't know, I know that everybody in the world loves the Beauty Blenders, and like I said, this is my first time trying it out, and I've always just been used to the Real Technique ones, um, but this is like really, really soft. And I don't know if I like that. I think that it's absorbing too much of the product, and not blending as fast as I would like it to. Uh, the Real Technique one is a, just a little bit stiffer, but it's still very uh, soft. And when you're bouncing it on, it gives you the most amazing coverage, but it diffuses every single thing that you do on your face. So, I don't know. But I do like it. Now with the same Beauty Blender, I'm going to go in and I'm going to do my under eye concealer. And for concealer, I'm going to be using the MAC Studio Finish Concealer. I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of a loose powder just to set the under eye area. Now that I have that, I'm just gonna go ahead and bronze up my face. I'm just gonna be using the Delphic uh, Bronzing Powder by MAC. And 
And then just going with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Palette with the one that I've been hitting the pan most and I can't wait to get it in the mail because I need a refill. So I'm contouring a little bit further. Now to finish off my cheeks, I'm gonna go ahead in with the uh, MAC Pleasure Model Blush and I'm just gonna warm up my face just a tad bit. And to finish off my skin, I'm gonna go in with my first product from my bag, which is the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Opal. I'll use the tiny little mirror that it comes with it. And this is the Morphe M501 brush. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do my brows off camera. If you guys wanna learn how to do your brows, check out my, my three ways on doing brows video. And yeah, I'll be right back. All right, so now that my brows are done, I'm gonna go back in with that same blush and I'm gonna run this through the crease of my eye just because I feel like I need a little color. But well, that's really all I'm gonna do because I wanna focus on that way I'm about to create. Okay, <clears throat> once I have that, I'm gonna be going in to my Kat Von D Tattoo Liner and Trooper and creating a fierce, sickening, long, thick wing. Okay, now that I have my wings on fleek, I'm gonna go underneath my eyes with this, which is the uh, Urban Decay eyeshadow in Mushroom. All right, so now that we're done with that, I'm gonna go in with my eyeliner. This is the uh, Beauty For Real eyeliner in Black Magic, and I'm just gonna go ahead and run it through my waterline. And I'm just going back in and just diffusing that eyeliner with a little bit of that mushroom eyeshadow. Now just to finish off the eyes, I'm going to go in with the Buxom Mascara and just coat my lashes. And just to finish off my whole look, I'm going to be going in with the NARS uh, Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in Cruella. And that's it guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Please remember to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my channel, and leave a comment telling me any other looks that you guys may want me to do in the future. Also, please remember to follow me on all social medias, that is Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter, all Rod underscore Germanata. I really hope you guys like this video, and until next time, stay fabulous.